Welcome back to my channel. This is J Max Reacts. Today we're continuing the most popular girls in school. This is season two, episode nine. Miss Cinnabon. Let's see what happens. <sighs> okay. Okay. Back to ones. <laughs> Note to self: Corn dogs and Mountain Dew do not mix, <laughs> especially when they are mixed with popcorn and jelly beans. And also six inches of fruit by the foot. Right. Mozzarella sticks, uh, uncooked bread dough, mango habanero wings, <laughs> and a shot of wheatgrass. Wheatgrass? Oh, okay. At least not for breakfast. Oh, shit. You, you was Try trying to... Try something out Mountain like Dew for Diet Mountain Dew. No. Leave the rest. Girl, <sighs> no. Trisha, what time did you say she was going to be here? Well, she said meet in front of the lids at four. <gasps> what if she meant a.m.? <gasps> What if she meant the lids at Westridge Mall? <gasps> what if she meant Eastern Standard Time? <gasps> Girl back. Psst. Mm -mm. Psst, psst. 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 What are you doing? Psst. Psst. What? Oh, sorry. I, uh, I thought you might have been fooled by my disguise. What disguise is that? A lesbian expected gadget? <laughs> uh <laughs> you know, Ashley, next time you want to hold a secret meeting, ew, I would suggest somewhere a little bit less public than the center of Oak Park Mall. Okay. Oh, well, I was going to invite you guys to my mom's apartment, but tonight's her bridge night, so. <gasps> you guys live under a bridge? <sighs> I will answer your riddle <laughs> three. Oh, never mind. Ashley got to Dorian, you said you had some dirt that we would be interested in? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, right. Well, um, word on the street is... Mackenzie Zale's got a debit card. What? Wait, does that help us? Wait, wait, wait. Here's the kicker. She got it in 2011. That added nothing to an already worthless fact. All right, okay. Strike one. Fair enough. Time to bring out the big guns. Okay. Word on the street is that Trisha is an only child. I am? But what about my brother? I'm so Does dying. he appear only to me? <gasps> Am I a ghost whisperer? No. Trisha! What? There's no way you'd be the ghost whisperer. Her breasts are insured for millions of dollars. You eat at McDonald's. Uh, okay. She's talking about the other Trisha. <gasps> the other Trisha is a ghost whisperer? Oh my god. Pretty juicy dirt, huh? No! How is knowing that Trisha Capaletti is an only child gonna help us beat Overland Park at Cheer Nationals? Well, um... Knowledge is power. Oh, all right. I think we heard enough here. Tanya. Wait, wait. I saved the juiciest morsel for the last. Juicier than the ghost whisperer? Ew. Anyway. Trisha! Word on the street is that Saison Marguerite is, get this, you guys, she's pregnant. <gasps> What's that? Uh, oh, my. She <laughs> was that. One of the cheerleaders at Overland Park is pregnant? Um, no. She's not pretty. No, she's, she's not, not actually a cheerleader. Well then, what is she? She's just a girl that goes to my school. And you told us this because... Well, you asked for juicy gossip. Anyway. And that <laughs> sounded pretty juicy to me. Girl! Okay, clearly I wasn't specific enough. <laughs> when we said we wanted dirt, we meant real dirt. Yeah, as in soil, like the stuff in the ground, idiot. No. <laughs> Dirt as in, here's your life, here's some dirt. And I done ruined your life with my dirt and now you dead. In the ground, which is where dirt is. <laughs> Full circle! Tay, you're about an eight right now, and I need you at about a six or less, okay? Yeah. No, I say okay, okay? Okay. Now, as I was saying, when I said dirt, I meant dirt that would lead me to victory at cheer nationals. Dirt as in... I don't know, Overland Park's cheer routine? Oh, well, I could have told you that from the beginning. Uh, it's actually pretty ingenious. Wait. They use pom-poms and megaphones. They spell out a few words and at the end, construct a human pyramid. There's also several flips and backhand springs throughout the routine. Oh my gee, you guys. They stole our routine. Oh, that's everybody's effing routine, Trisha. Okay. <gasps> I'm sorry for the strong language. I really am. Just specifics, Ashley. What I need are specifics. And by that you mean... Like, 
What kind of music are they using? What words are being spelled out? What color are their pom-poms? Do they actually have spirit and do other people hear it? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, I actually got to practice late, so I missed all that stuff. What? Going to stores and then buying things. <laughs> Hopefully, I make a stop at the food court. Ah, Satan! Oh. <laughs> well, look who it is, girls. Fancy running into you here, Not Deandra. Satan. I believe you have me confused with somebody else. Really? You mean to tell us you are not Deandra, the former handspring specialist of the Atchison High Lady Jaguar Cheer Squad? Nope. My name is, um, um, mm -mm. Cinnabon. Cinnabon. Yeah, Juliet Cinnabon. <gasps> oh my God, Miss Cinnabon, may I just say that it is truly an honor to make your acquaintance. I am a huge fan of your products. Oh, well, thank you. Uh, anyway. May I be so bold as to say that butter is not only a friend, it is an ally. Trisha! Sorry. <laughs> One last thing, though. The caramel pecan bun, is it locked up at night? Trisha! That's my it. favorite, too. You had a fat freshman year. <laughs> Deandra, I must say that I am surprised to find you here. Although, where else would human filth go other than Overland Park? <laughs> can, I, can, I, can, I, can I fill? <laughs> oh, my God. I got it. Understand that the three of you have been rattling the cage of the Overland Park cheer squad? Yeah, so why do you care? Take it from somebody who knows. Probably not the best idea. Oh, really, Deandra? What are they gonna do? <laughs> Call us the C word and threaten to have intercourse with our butts? <laughs> okay. Butts are got seat cushions. Oh, no. Well, I mean, yes, you will get a lot of that from them. But trust me, the C word and butt talk are the least of your worries. <laughs> Did you do something with your hair? Oh my god. Listen, Deandra, why don't you mind your own goddamn... Taylor! Why don't you mind your own gosh darn business and leave the cheer squad to us? And if you try and get in our way, we might have to let everyone in Overland Park know why you had to leave our school in such a hurry. You wouldn't. Would I? Is it your dress? Did you get a new dress? Girl! Listen. <laughs> I don't know what your game is in Overland Park. It's the mall. We want the mall. The mall? You have your own fucking mall in Atchison. It burned down. This one's here, so we here. <gasps> it burned down? Even the carousel? Carousel was the first thing to go. R.I.P. Mr. Clip Clop. Well, regardless, <laughs> the Overland Park cheer squad will literally rip you limb from limb. All right. I think we're being a little... Look at me! You think this was a fucking mill accident? You think I'm fucking Bethany Hamilton from fucking Soul Surfer? <laughs> they literally ripped me limb from limb. And I wasn't even the one they were mad at! Ah! It's her arm, you guys. She got a new arm. Tanya, Taylor, Trisha, I suggest you leave Overland Park and never look back. Okay. They did this to me for a bathroom. Imagine what they'll do for an entire mall. Ooh. I get it, Deandra. You want us out of Overland Park so nobody finds out your little secret. Well, nice try. But we're not going anywhere. Oh. All right. I tried using logic and I tried to reason with you guys. Oh. Now it's about right out. Either you three leave Overland Park of your own accord, or I use my titanium robot arm to forcibly expel you from Overland Park, okay. followed by all of your organs shortly thereafter. Got it? Oh, please. You wouldn't hurt a fly. You're right. Because a fly is an innocent creature that never knowingly did anything to anybody. You, however, I would maim. Oh, Do you oh. believe me? Oh! <laughs> Fuck. You know that girl goes to Overland Park, right? Really? I oh. thought it was a tiny flasher. Oh my god. That was impressive, Deandra. However, know this. 
if you ever resort to using violence against any member of my cheer squad, I will make sure that every citizen of Overland Park knows exactly why you left Atchison in such a cloud of shame. Oh, damn. And don't even think about talking to the cheer squad about this. Yeah, because I've seen every single RoboCop, and I know how to take you out. I'm not afraid of you, okay? Girl. The three things I'm afraid of are Joseph Gordon-Levitt, the film adaptation of Mario Brothers, and the word colander. Come on, Trish, we're leaving. Goodbye, Deandra. I mean, Miss Cinnabon. Anyway. <laughs> Come to think of it, Cinnabon actually does sound pretty good. It right? does. Now I'm on the cinnamon roll. Hmm. Do they still make Surge soda? You guys, I landed in the fountain. Oh, okay. Can someone help me out? <laughs> it's pretty deep. It's a pretty deep fountain, you guys. I'm not too hurt, but this jacket is very heavy when it's wet. It's like an anchor. Yeah. Guys, I can't float for much longer. Okay, seriously? Ow! Oh, who is still throwing coins in? Come on! <laughs> None of your wishes are coming true. Can you give me a hand, though? No, you're just gonna walk away? Oh, okay. No, I get it. I would walk away from me too. I'm done. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. Now I really want to know what Deandra's secret is. I'm pretty sure we'll find out hopefully in the next couple of episodes. But yeah, I forgot they tore her limb from limb. And you know, if you think about it, if I saw some shit like that, I wouldn't want to fuck with this um, chess squad either. But <laughs> so good. And now I definitely want a Cinnabon. I'm going home for Christmas this weekend. I'm definitely going to get a, Cinnab uh, a Cinnabon. But let me know what you thought about this below. Comment, like, subscribe. Until next time, peace.